So I got this Devoom Pixio 64 behind me and I changed some things in the app and I was so confused how to get these custom rotations. So here's a collection with pictures I found funny that I found on the app and I wanted to rotate through them. You can have like three channels, custom one, two and three. So you can have three collections in a sense. You can either do that with pictures you already found on that app or you can upload or make them yourself. So first, when you used to go to the middle, there used to be a tab with custom things. It's like all gone. So I was super confused. What I did then is I like, I searched on pictures like Mario, for example. It was like, oh, this Princess Peach is cool. So I clicked on Princess Peach and then I clicked on this button and then I added them to custom two. Well, this makes the diffume go to custom two. It's loading and you can immediately see Peach there. So it will restart the custom two at the one that you just edit. However, I just didn't know how to get here without adding something, but I found it out. So I'm going to tell you how to do it because I couldn't find it anywhere on the internet. I was like searching so, so, so long and I, I did find it. So <laughs> here's how you do it. So you go back to this main menu, then here you see all kinds of clocks. And I didn't realize that the top part says pixel art and custom two, three, and one. So they could be a little bit further. They could you could have like the visualizer first, for example. And then here, my custom two, if I click on this, we can see this is the collection that we actually have with the Mario and Zelda images in it. And we can just add them by clicking on plus and search them, or we can just edit them like I just did at the Peach one. And we can also switch to custom tree, which is this lock now. Or we can switch to custom one, which is a Twitch logo. Click on the bottom part of it. You can add and see which images are in this collection. If you want to add a custom one, you click on the middle part and then plus. Here you can draw something yourself in either 64 or I don't know what kind of grid you want to use. <laughs> or you can click on the plus and go to camera. And then here you can pick an image. Let's say I pick this image of myself. And then you can click on OK and it pixelizes it. If you see mistakes in it, like my mouth here is not looking that great. What we can do is we can actually paint over that one pixel. Like stick the pixel next to it. And I make these two pixels the same color. And now my two look, don't look that weird anymore. <laughs> and then if we save this, you can share it to anybody or not nobody. You can call it whatever you want. It's me, it's Drewy. Publish it. And then it's waiting for approval. And then it's gonna like appear in little uploads and now here we have the same thing as with the other pictures before we can click on here and now we can add them to custom one for example if we go back to this channel we go to custom one we can see it appeared in here next to the twitch logo if we switch to custom one we will see the twitch logo and we will see me <laughs> we can delete them out of the customs again by going here clicking on the image you want to delete and then click on delete you can also set timers for these customs uh, or just leave them off I had so much trouble and struggling finding this, so I hope it helped somebody. <laughs> I usually make a lot of videos about streaming and how to set up your stream. Obviously, it's super cool to have a Twitch logo behind you or your subscribers or something like that on Twitch. So if you want to grow on Twitch, I do have a playlist here about how to grow on Twitch. So let's jump in that together.